If you're here tonight, say praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. All right, you're here tonight. Well, it's good to start off our concert season again this year uh, with Andy Avery. And uh, we've been threatening for several years to be Andy Avery and his band. Well, we made it happen tonight. We made it happen. So, yeah. I want to thank all of you for coming uh, tonight. And uh, we've just been praying for uh, God to be among us this evening and to lead, guide, guard, direct, thrill, encourage, strengthen, all of those things tonight. And uh, uh, they're going to do their... Uh, first set, and then after that, we will uh, take up a uh, free will offering. And uh, at that point, uh, then they'll come back up and uh, do another set. And the great thing is, uh, not only do we have uh, a great concert tonight, uh, but we're going to uh, come back tomorrow morning, and uh, we've chosen to have our church service uh, out in the great outdoors uh, tomorrow morning at 1030. So uh, you're welcome to come back uh, for that as well. If you don't show up for church, I'm coming to your house and eat all your food. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. There you go. <laughs> so in a month from now, on July 28th, uh, our uh, Beginnings Care for Life uh, benefit concert is going to be with Jason Gray. And you can... Uh, Look him up and see that that's going to be a great night of, of music and we'll be able to help out, help out the Beginnings Care for Life Center uh, as well. And we just nailed that down uh, earlier this week. Uh, so we're thankful that we've been able to do that. So uh, with the encouragement you've given us tonight, uh, let's bring on uh, the Andy Avery, Andy Avery and his band.
be a, a nice little eight hour drive turned into a 12 and a half hour drive. Well, it was supposed to be 10 o'clock arrival time, turned into a quarter to one arrival time last night. And y'all know my sleeping habits, and they are very poor. I have Facebook friends that also Facebook me at like three o'clock in the morning. I don't know what that says about her, but, but you know, we're the three o'clock in the morning club. I can't sleep. So I'm just telling you that for one reason and one reason only. It may get a little goofy tonight. That's all I'm gonna say. It's the lack of sleep thing, you know. And uh, I tell you what, man, this is some fancy stuff right here. I feel like I should run for the Miss Michigan pageant or something, you know. I'm coming down the aisle there. Hey, you might recognize this old tune.
This is my twin brother. You might notice the family resemblance. We were separated. Good child, here you go. I stood on many books for family pictures. You ready? understand that we have a, a birthday in the house over here to my left uh, so I need all three of you ladies to come up here for a little birthday celebration come on give them some love ladies and gentlemen give them some love come on we're yep if you're my Facebook friend you get picked on and it's your birthday dun, 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 dun. hey we know that It's Lynn's birthday tonight, ladies and gentlemen. Give her some love tomorrow, but it's tonight. And uh, she will be 33 years old tomorrow morning when she wakes up. Here we go, everybody. Uh, if you got a microphone, join in. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday. God bless you. Step on over to the microphone, all three of you ladies. And when I sing this, don't be shy there, little darling. When I sing this, all I want to do is ride around. Sally, you sing. How they doing? How they doing? Mustang Sally. I guess you better slow your Mustang down.
Um, girls should get paid 10%. 10% of nothing, still pretty much nothing. So do the math. I'm not sure. <laughs> Andy, I think of all the times we've done this, these guys were the best. You know what? They did pretty good. They did they? pretty good, I'm they telling you. They did pretty now. good. Seriously, you guys, I'm dead serious. You were the best we've ever had when we drafted people. No joke. Now, here's, here's, he said that last week, and he'll say it again next week. So, you know, take that for what it's, you own that, right? You own that crown for six days. So. <laughs> um, this is the uh, CMA Country Song of the Year from 2016. And I worked it up because it, it's actually a recovery song. And I didn't know this. It was written by Hank Williams, or not Hank Williams, George Jones, and redone uh, by Chris Stapleton. And it's a song about when he meets the love of his life, he quits drinking. So that's what this song's about. Check it out. It's a song called Tennessee Whiskey.
singing actual love is the only love I'd ever known. Then you came and rescued me from the bottom. Oh, you brought me back. You brought me back. came about so uh, here we are and uh, what a what a pleasure this is a, a beautiful setting it seems uh, just a natural connection and uh, you can't ask for anything better folks thank you so much for your hospitality of having us here I, uh, here's the real deal as some of you know I, I travel with a touring band opening up for famous acts and then ah. playing large arenas and those guys when I call them on the phone here's the recent thing I don't know I have much they got a hotel and I said here's the deal you're all fired you're not coming with me anymore if all you do is complain about stuff so instead of bringing them I brought my family so give my family a big round of applause right here all from the same hometown these are all my brothers hey we're gonna get a little funky on you this is an old temptation song redone by delbert mcclinton this is an old funky song and if people don't dance i'm i'm gonna eat all your food this is a song called shaky ground hit it up <laughs> Wait. 
battery change. Tell us about yourself. Pardon me? Tell us about yourself. Do I know? Tell us about yourself. Tell us about you. Me? Yeah. What am I doing? Yeah. Who are you? Oh, my name is Mervyn Kuzmicki. I was born in Kalamazoo, Michigan. Not really, but that's not true. My real name is... I'm getting to that. I'm getting to that stuff. Y'all just be patient. Good Lord. <laughs> but I'm going to introduce right now, also from Burlington, Iowa, the drum representative of the 2018 Iowa Rock and Roll Hall of Fame inductee. He's going to sing an old, old, old classic country song for you. Please welcome to Coldwater, Michigan, to the bowl, Nudie Bender. Come on, Nudie. His real name is Dwayne, but his grandma calls him Nudie. <laughs> See, Charlie. Yep. Sorry, boys. We haven't done this before, so one, we don't know the key. A two, a one, two. You know what to do. Goodbye, Joe. We gotta go. Hey, oh my, oh. We gotta go. Yeah. 
preach a message tomorrow. Most of you know my testimony, but uh, some of you might not. Where'd those girls go? This is for them. And uh, back in the 80s, I uh, uh, toured with Kiss and Bon Jovi and Aerosmith and bands like that. And, and uh, I ran into some uh, bumps in the road, which I like to call it, to where uh, um, the only reason I was playing music, and I had a discussion with Tammy over here, the only reason I was playing music was for drugs and alcohol. And that's not a good reason to be playing music. And uh, I have one of these things that I say uh, no longer, I, I don't want to use the word miracle because in my arena that I minister to, if you use that, people are expecting some big thing to happen in their lives immediately. And I got to be honest with you folks, that's not the way it works. Here's how it works for me. When someone calls me up and says, hey, can your band get to cold water and play in the middle of this thing we call the bowl and it's storming out. We come upon wreck after wreck, and it takes us 12 and a half, and a half hours to get here. You know what my answer is? Absolutely. Because I seek Christ and serve Christ with the same amount of enthusiasm that I used to serve that other stuff. Not a miracle. We serve a mighty God that chooses what he wants to do with us. Amen? It's up to us to follow. So he put me in the hospital, ripped my left vocal cord out of my neck, taught me how to sing again, spit me out of his mouth like Jonah in the whale and said, go do my bidding, which I created for you to do in the first place. Amen? It is by his grace that I'm here to do his bidding. We dedicate this next four songs to that very notion. Love that. 
Yeah. You're tearing me 
songs for you at the last concert, I get to pick the ones at this concert. So grab your little slide finger thingy there. 